वेलकम बैक गाइस हाउ आर यू ऑल आई नेम दिस शिप क्वीन एलिजाबेथ द सेकंड God bless her and all who sail in her. Hello guys, welcome back. I am here standing in front of the historic gem and the only floating hotel in Dubai. It's called as Queen Elizabeth II, which is located in Port Rashid. Back to its history, this was built in the year of 1967 in Scotland and it was named as Queen Elizabeth II. The ship had its first voyage of world cruise covering around 38000 miles at sea during the year of 2018 this ocean liner was completely refurbished and it was converted into a floating hotel in dubai as per my knowledge this ocean liner consists of around more than 400 distinctive rooms now it's time for me to explore inside the queen elizabeth 2 the historic gem which is a retired ocean liner bought by the Dubai investment company called as Sistema during the year of 2008 Also during the year of 2002 this ocean liner had uh, set a record of covering around 5 million miles at the sea This is the only ocean liner which has set that record of covering 5 million miles This is inside the room where I am staying right now. So I will show you the ocean view, how it will look like from here.
required you can close this as well this is the dental kit completely made out of biodegradable materials sustainable
Portable Casino in December 1970. The biggest win ever happened in 1975, where one lady walked away with $12,500. A lot of money for 1975, and even for today it still is a lot of money. But unfortunately, the machines are only for display because gambling is strictly prohibited here in the UAE. It's however been confirmed that it's coming and slated to begin in 2026, but in Ras Al Khaimah. So, engineering informed us that the machines are in perfect working condition. If the laws ever change and they allow gambling here in Dubai, we just need to plug in our motors and hey, we are ready to start losing our money again. <laughs> This casino was strictly for the passenger sailing on board.